on Capitol Hill today, a powerful congressman will reveal a plan to simplify the federal tax code. His bill would cut the highest rate from nearly 40 percent to 25 percent. It would also end many deductions. The author spoke with Nancy Cordes in an interview you'll see only on CBS This Morning. Nancy, good morning. Charlie and Nora, believe it or not, this is only part of the nation's tax code. It runs 10 thousand pages and everyone who pays taxes knows that it's overly complicated and in some cases just unfair. So Michigan Republican Dave Camp is going to try to convince his colleagues that it's finally time to clean up the code. Our code is overly complex, as I like to say, ten times the size of the Bible with none of the good news. And so it's really a wet blanket over our economy. Congressman Camp cheers the committee that writes tax law, ways and means. His plan would compress the current seven personal tax brackets down to just two, 10% and 25%, with an extra 10% surtax on some income for those making over $400,000 a year. Why only two tax brackets? Well, it's much simpler. And one of the things we do is actually raise the standard deduction so fewer people itemize. So that's a huge simplification aspect. Under his plan, Camp says a family of four making $51,000 a year would pay an average $1,300 less in yearly taxes. The corporate rate would drop from 35% to 25%, and in exchange, a long list of special interest giveaways would be eliminated. Give us some ideas of which loopholes you'd like to close. Well, certainly corporate jets is one of them. Uh, that's one thing that we look at. Past attempts to close loopholes have met with fierce resistance. That's one reason Congress has not managed to seriously overhaul the tax code since 1986. But that's not Camp's only obstacle. Do you think that the Senate should be tackling tax reform this year as well? Yeah, I don't see how we can. Congressional leaders from both parties appear reluctant to take up such an explosive issue. They say mistrust between the two sides is just too high. It would be extremely difficult with the obstruction that we get here from the Republicans on virtually everything. One of the biggest sticking points is that Democrats believe that any large overhaul of the tax code should lead to more revenue for the federal government, while Republicans disagree. But this is Chairman Camp's last year, Nora and Charlie, as chairman of the committee. So he wanted to try to give this a shot, see if he can get some momentum building on both sides. All right, Nancy Cordes, thank you.